The reveal for Call of Duty Black Ops 6 will be held today, and we are going to be getting a whole bunch of information. So while the event will be happening, we are already receiving some leaks about the game. And some of these leaks sound so good to be true, but please remember even going into this video any further that everything in this video is subject to change, even these leaks. These are leaks at the end of the day and it could end up being false. But I do want to preface also that this information is coming from a reliable leaker who has been right before. So anything I do say, I do personally believe, but it is at your own cost too. I just want to get that out the way. Before I continue saying anything else, the information I mention in this video is going to be coming from Bob Network UK. His link will be in the description if you do care to check out any of his information for yourself. Apparently Black Ops 6 is going to be DLC and I don't believe it. First off, this is going to be integrated into the Call of Duty HQ and obviously it is a full packaged premium game costing about $70. I know that's not really a leak, but I did really want to clear this up for people who are misunderstanding that. I know a lot of false information can be spread on the internet, but this is one of those things that I don't think a lot of people were fact checking. So to get into the leaks, which are too good to be true, and I am remaining optimistic because of this information. So to start off, we are going to be getting theater mode. And this has been a staple for the Call of Duty franchise for such a long time. I don't know why they take out things and put them back in when no one wants anything changed i think call of duty has a bad rep because of this right i can't be the only one who thinks about this they take out certain things from certain call of duty games and then they put it into newer call of duty games just so people can praise them like it's kind of dumb and it's kind of ridiculous that the fact that we're getting hyped over theater mode coming back but i couldn't be any happier and this is for people who want to go back and check things and get clips for videos montages and all that so this is a very good thing coming i haven't been on call of duty in such a long time and i can't really remember the last time that it was in a call of duty game but carrying on this one's going to excite a lot of people including myself like everything I mentioned in this video could probably be held for the last couple of things but i kind of wanted to talk about this primarily and that is prestige mode so currently in the newest call of duties we have seasonal prestige and i think this is a terrible system in itself i like ranking up on my own account not doing it when everyone else is doing it like it sounds kind of dumb the way i word it but it really is the way it is and it's terrible i have to wait a new season just to rank up it's terrible man i don't enjoy it i love the old system where everyone can just rank up and you can become prestige 10 on your own account and it really is a better system overall i don't really like the current seasonal prestige system as i mentioned this next one is interesting so to start off black ops 6 is going to be introducing a mechanic where you can sprint, slide, and dive in any direction, which is going to be for sure shaking up the Call of Duty movement. The last leak we will be talking about involves two new round-based zombie maps that will be coming at the launch of Call of Duty Black Ops 6, which sounds really good and a better direction for the zombie side of Call of Duty because Call of Duty really hasn't hit it in years when it comes to zombies. And if we're looking at this year's Call of Duty, I mean, last year's call of duty which was modern warfare 3 and i don't even want to call it a zombies mode because it was just realistically battle royale with zombies which kind of sucked but i enjoyed it for what it was i wasn't really too thrilled about it but i will say it's not the worst thing in the world right but for this the call of duty side of zombies it really hasn't hit in years as i'm mentioning it and we really haven't seen a good call of duty experience when it comes to zombies since black ops 3. with all the leaks i've mentioned in this video what excites you the most and is it really going to draw you into this year's call of duty because if i'm being honest call of duty has not hit the same 
for the last couple years and I feel like this is the last chance for me because I might not even pick up this year's Call of Duty to be quite honest especially because of SBMM but that's just me everybody is different but other than that guys I hope you guys definitely do have a great day and I enjoyed this video I will catch you guys in the next one